guys, this is Shelly with TeenKing247.com coming to you with Monday's Motivation. And our topic today is going to be about having the right purpose of heart. And in the last episode, we kind of touched upon it a little bit, but today we're going to expound on it just a little bit more. And so what I want to share with you all is something that we were taught again today in our uh, Sunday worship service. And in today's teaching, he kind of expounded or defined rather um, what love really is. And one of the definitions that resonated uh, deeply with me was this one, having the correct action with the correct motivation. And I'll say that again, having the correct action with the correct motivation. And so what I want to or would like to encourage all of us is when we are going about our day working our business whatever it is you may be doing make sure you have the right purpose of heart when you do it and the way you can check your heart condition is this make sure you are being selfless and not selfish selfless but not selfish meaning you're thinking outside of yourself you're looking to how your product or service can benefit others versus being a benefit to you. You know that when you act and when you do those things that you know will edify someone else, the reward or the rebound comes back to you. And that's what the most fulfilling part is. Not only will your heart be filled, but what's the residual effect of that? If you want to think in monetary terms. The residual effect is that you get uh, a monetary benefit. On top of that, the, the second thing I want to share with you is make sure that you're, that you're sharing because you care. Make sure that those things that you are sharing, whether it's about your product or service, is because you care about the well-being of the person that you're talking to, the person that you're interacting with at that very point in time. Make sure you're not sharing because you're looking to make a, share, a sale, but make sure you're sharing because you genuinely care for the person that you're interacting with at that point of time. And then the last thing I want to point out to you is that make sure your passion that you have for your business moves you to compassion. I'll say that again. Your passion moves you to compassion. You're passionate about your business. That's a guarantee because you wouldn't be in it if you weren't. But make sure your passion moves you to compassion. Meaning it goes hand in hand with the second thing that we said. Meaning that you're sharing because you're caring. Your passion is moving you to compassion because you feel need, the need or necessary to give these those that you're interacting with the things that will help benefit them what that will help edify them that will help take their life to the next level that will help them better the state that they're in move your make sure your passion is moving you to compassion i hope this was a blessing to you all if it was i appreciate you or we will appreciate you leaving your comments below liking and sharing our video if you are watching this on youtube be sure to give us a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel let us know what you think um and be sure that you are staying connected with us so that you can be notified about the next episode when it gets uploaded until next time this is shelly with team king 247.com telling you to stay in it to win it you guys have a great day